Okay, yeah, yeah, so what? I'm a little albino. What's up? <laughs> I'm I'm a sunburnt kind of a lobster white boy. Big deal. I can't tan. Okay, I can burn for sure. I just passed this place after I was walking down this nature hiking biking trail. I'm passing this like tanning salon in and out or people smoking cigarettes and they look like burnt freaking microwave oven <laughs> horse saddles. But on the cover, on the windows of this entrance is this huge sign that says, hey, embody your true colors. Embody your true colors. Like, you're not good enough. You need to embody your true colors. Look, whatever shade of the hue spectrum you're on, <laughs> from me being albino, burnt red lobster white, to whatever darkest color. I don't know. Can you just be please... Please, I implore you to be most confident in your own skin. Be confident within your skin, your skin color. None of that shit matters, man. But boy, aren't they making money off of us. Isn't that some really powerful promotional advertising, some social conditioning that says, hey, embody your true colors. <laughs> You're not tan enough. Or what? What? They don't got some bleaching system, do they, for the darker brothers? Like, do they? Do they have? Do they have? Do they really have something that can embody your true colors? Like, if you think you're too dark, can they bleach your ass? Like, what the f? It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. What a horrible example of the human species that we have tanning salons that prove. We are insufficient. We're just, we're not good enough. And um, anyways, I'm walking past this place, spitting on the windows. I'm like, F you guys, man. I'm happy with my albino red lobster bullshit. <laughs> I gotta take a pee. I could have taken a pee back in this nature trail. I could have done that, but I saved you from seeing that. Because you need to embody your true... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I go into a gas station. And um, I know these guys by names. I'm like, what's up, guys? What's up? What's up? I'm walking all cool guy. Cool guy. <laughs> I got to use the restroom. Do you ever use public restrooms? Do you ever use gas station public restrooms? Has that not put a halt in your entire life career? Like You're like, wow. Wow. This place has been destroyed. What do you do? I, what I do is not touch anything with my bare fingertips. I don't. I use my shirt to turn the door handle. I use my shirt to close it behind me. I use my shirt <laughs> to turn the deadlock knob. <laughs> here come some bicyclists. <laughs> Let me look over here for a minute. So I do all that nastiness, right? I don't want to touch any ick. I feel the whole world of ick when I enter a public restroom. So, also, I grab the paper uh, toilet seat covers. I use that to flush the toilet, crumple it up, throw it in the bowl. I use that to wipe the, the rim of the bowl. I use that to sometimes uh, turn the sink knob. I will not touch with my bare hands anything in a public restroom, especially a gas station restroom. Forgive me, gas station attendants. What a quick getaway that was. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> it grosses me out so much. More so, I don't want to be associated with the mess. Sometimes I walk in, I see a devastating event, and I actually use the paper towel, the uh, toilet seat covers, and I, and I wipe it all off before I use it. I need the person behind me to know, if there's someone behind me, to associate my face with a clean toilet bowl, because I know the gas station attendants may not be as cleanly as, as, as I am. And I don't want to be associated with anything other, but other than cleanliness. Even at a public gas station. Isn't that weird? That's my OCD just fucking kicking in. Okay, so that's all I gotta say. I hope all the best for you and yours. Be proud of who you are. I don't care what color you are. Color doesn't matter. Also, what does matter, actually more than color of your skin, is the cleanliness of toilet seats and bathroom and, and public restrooms, you know? I, I really think we should reassess our priorities. Much love to you and yours. Bye.